Yes. It's just anesthetic. I'll be fine. Anesthetic? I oh, wait. No, I misread that. That, say, that says sulfur dioxide. Oh, dear. oh dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> While we were searching the hospital rooms, I thought it might be useful later. No, wait. Oh, shit. No. Viagra. <laughs> I oh, think June, I might need to use you. <laughs> using it on myself. Oh, oh I can't. Let's get over here. Didn't I tell you? I'd like to take a nap. I really am very oh. tired. Ace. So he's actually decided to kill himself. Hmm? No, he's not killing himself. He's just took. He's just took an anesthetic. Say, I just like to sleep. And he's just taking a little nap. Could you? It down. No, don't, Ace, don't fall asleep. Uh, I'll fall asleep. I want a mummy. Warm. So calm. I think I'll have a nice. I think dream. I'll have a nice. Dream. <laughs> Ace, oh, God, he shit Ace. himself. Oh, there goes his bowels. Ace, Ace. Uh, let's get him up on a bed. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> Jesus, his shit came out like a cannon! <laughs> we can't let his I think that's what happens hell? when you die. Right? Not like that! <laughs> <laughs> it's a gradual thing, not a cannon! <laughs> it's like just confetti just shot out of him! <laughs> We're not done choosing yet, are we? I think he didn't die from a drug overdose. What do you mean? I think well, that was the <laughs> Yes, that's true. Enough of this screwing around. Let's decide. You first. Right, you need to go through a specific door, door here. I um, I want door number eight. And you're yeah, not the... gonna like it. It's the same number as my bracelet number. Are, are you wanting to go? Wait, wait. We gotta pick a specific door. Yeah, and you're not gonna like the choice. <laughs> oh, okay. You're eight. You're next seven. Which one do you want? I'll take seven. I can't get along with that old lady. <laughs> what? What did you just say? Who, me? I, I didn't say nothing. I didn't say nothing. Get it next time. All right. I'm gonna kill What's you next? with my tits. Uh, Which door do you can want? you? <laughs> Which door we need, then? You need door number eight. So we're going with bitch. You have to. I... I... I think I'm gonna go with door eight. Okay. Eight it is. Yeah. All right then. That means June's got to go through seven. What? Why? What? If the six of us are gonna keep going without leaving anyone behind, there are only three ways we can do it. Have three, five, and eight go through seven, and four, six, and seven go through eight. Four, five, and seven go through seven, and three, six, and eight go through eight. Or three, six, and seven go through seven, and four, five, and eight get eight. There are no other combinations. You know, right. three and four and seven and eight can never go through the same doors. You get it now? Oh no. You're saying we aren't gonna see each other again for a long time. Uh hey, come on. You're making it sound like we're never gonna see each other again. Got to split up, but only for a while. This is who's bloody phones, Vegan? This what is with this music? We got split up then too, but we all met back up. 
I'll bet seven and eight are just. Are you like sure that. this isn't just some weird dream and you just you didn't wake up from the flipping from the flipping third floor Probably. cabin and you just drowned? Probably. Yeah, I'm sure they're gonna connect somewhere. Why? What makes you think so? I mean, we got. I mean, we got here. Neither team can get through door nine. Guys, um, I'm looking at my watch, and we've got like like 30 minutes to go. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, we've been talking all the time. Zero's to kill. been on top of his shit so far. I don't think he. You, you guys talk too much. <laughs> damn sure that son of a bitch wants to have his fun as long as possible. He's not gonna stop talking until we get through the nine door. Stop talking. Wait, you think that's gonna stop them from talking? Stop talking. <laughs> If that's if, if that was the way to stop them from talking, then that would have stopped them from talking. But it's not going to stop them from talking because visual novels have this big of a, of, a, of them actually being wow, all about Santa, talking. You're a dick. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Clover and I will both go into separate groups. I figure I'll take seven, and Clover can take eight. Any problems with that, Clover? Whatever. <laughs> You've right, got bitch and go, someone then. who told you off. <laughs> Let's move. I hate this version of Reen. Are you ready? Yeah. You hate this version of Taka Ishibaru. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Then shall we go? Yes. <laughs> oh, what, what is open. this from smell? Okay. Hurry! It's yeah. a zombie again. <laughs> No, when you hear that, it's basically they've got a, yeah. a certain amount of time before it goes off. Jumpy, what the hell are you doing? Go, quick! You got to find the dead in eighty-one seconds. Eighty-one seconds left. Hurry! Ugh. There we go. That was easy. Almost makes you wonder why we even have a time limit to begin with. It stopped. Yeah, it doesn't contribute to the game or anything that like you don't have to search around the room to find the thing pointless. yeah even clover what faces pointless unpleasant girl what an unpleasant you all want to yeah that's what i say you all want to talk i bet she's not very popular with the boys she's 14 hmm, maybe pairing these two together was a mistake no it's perfect <laughs> too late now i better catch up to them no words perfect this is the perfect pairing oh, that's a dead end there's a door on the left, though. Then it's not a dead end, then. <laughs> Tori. Huh. Oh my god, this is becoming Resident Evil, isn't it? Oh, that doesn't no. sound very pleasant. I don't like the look of it. It's becoming place. Dexter's lab. We're gonna have we're gonna find Dee Dee in here. There aren't any other doors. In Dexter's laboratory. With the smartest boy you've ever seen. <laughs> but Dee Dee blows his experiments to smithereens. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember the rest. Yeah, I it's that it's kinda like the weird thing with some songs like you you think you know them well enough, but then you try singing and you're like fucking shit. No, What's this is a laboratory, this is a bathroom! We look at bathroom. Monitoring something. What the hell? It looks so creepy. Oh look, a dead body. Like that doll is Bark! Bark! <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't even trying to make that joke. Like Ooh, money! Ooh, a dead body. Bark! <laughs> Bark! Uh oh. Ooh, uh, it's not a dead body. That's that's just a dummy. Don't think Could that be a robot. Suddenly, sit up or something. Do you? Could be Richard. Well, oh. I don't know. So He's that's where Rich. So that's where Rich has been all this time. <laughs> oh! Huh. He's been sleeping in here the whole time. The lazy git. <laughs> Wait, and who's Wait, this we're playing with then? Where's Clover? Uh. <laughs> what is she? Are you okay? What are you talking about? What? I'm just worried about you. You've been real quiet. What? Can't, can't I can't be, quiet? be quiet if I want to? <laughs> well, I mean, of course you can. I, I just... Okay, then. If I can be quiet if I want, just leave me alone, okay? Come on, you know I can't do that. We gotta work together. Junpei, you just don't get it! What don't I get? Well, my brother's not the kind of person who just leave me herpes. behind! What, what does herpes have to do with this? Him. 
something bad. Yeah. What happened? Look, just don't bother me, okay? Leave me alone. Hey, wait, Clover. Hold on. That way is. I told you to leave me alone. No way. No way is shit. <laughs> no, no. It's like she runs into a trap or something like that. Clover, watch out above you. Ah. Uh -huh. Hey, look, you're right. What the heck? What's going on here? Hang I mean, you're locked in. See, this is what happens when you ignore people. You'll never do it on your own. Uh, 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 um, God damn! God damn! All I have is women on my team. Damn it! It's not moving. Wait, uh, come on! Be an independent woman and open this door. Not, yeah. <laughs> one of damn it! If only. God damn it! it is. Put it's use your it. breast to lift the door open. <laughs> Just what I was thinking. Now all we gotta do is find it. Lotus and I can look around out here. Clover, you're gonna have to see Go on, open, break these there. metal bars. Oh wait, I'm sorry, you can't even break the glass ceiling. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> very funny. It. Yes. Impressions. <laughs> Alright, so this this puzzle is gonna be a little bit more different. Seek a way out. I don't wanna. <laughs> I'll okay. seek a way out spiritually. Shing. <laughs> okay. So. So again, like I said, like I said, this puzzle's going to be a bit more different. To mm. different. Let's have a look around what we got. Okay. So. A window made of really thick glass. I don't even think a bullet could break it. Okay. Uh. Jun Junpei. Do something, please. No, but that I choose. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, Wait, fuck okay. you then. <laughs> boxes. They're cardboard boxes. There's some papers and stuff in them. Uh. What's in What's in the boxes? They look oh, look in your full. box. That's what you're asking. As far as I can tell, it's a bunch of notes about some kind of experiments. It's really technical stuff. I don't really get it. What do we have here? Check. Oh, oh, yeah, okay, check. that was open. Uh, ooh, drugs. This is ethanol. No, 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 no don't, don't drink that. I ooh, 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 ethanol. Ooh, oh. ethanol. I better smell it just in case. Oh, it's damaged. It's ethanol. Oh come, on. come on, that's common knowledge. And just now, ethanol is a powerful cleaner. It can even erase, even erase marks left by a, by a permanent marker. Oh well, that's useful to know. Uh, what do we have down here? Those lockers are a lot lower larger than the ones on top. No shit. Let's see if there's anything useful in here. And no, nothing. Uh, computer. Can we turn this on? The keyboard. This is the computer. The power isn't on. Well, there's a power button. Hmm? This is a waste of time. You're a waste of time. What? I don't see a power cable. Oops. Yeah, you're right. No power cable. Missing isn't even connected to the main computer. It isn't connected. Isn't connected to the main computer though. It's got a monitor, keyboard, and mouse, but that's it. Just sticking the power cable isn't going to do anything. Oh, I don't know about that. Hmm. Try examining again. Hmm. Power cable, huh? Uh, all right. So you need to find a power cable. Mouse. So I need to find a <laughs> power cable then. You may want to turn your camera. Oh. <laughs> Check around here. Uh huh. There's a lot. There's a lot. Yeah, There's sorry. a lot of stuff here. I don't know. How we could use any of these. And my screen's gone. There we go. Hmm. Well, I can say for sure that that I do know how to use at least one of these things. Which one? The one on top. I think it's a power cable. The power cable, huh? Oh wait, that computer needed a power cable. <laughs> Free prong power cable. Sweet. Alright, go and check it. The monitor doesn't have a power cable, so one end needs to be connected to the monitor, and the other needs to be plugged in under the desk. Alright, let's just slip you in and. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Well, shoot, I can't use this. What's well, wrong? The cable has three prongs, but the socket only has two holes. It's not gonna fit, is what I'm saying. 
I know what it was. We're gonna need to find a plug to change the power cable to a to a one with two prongs. That's to the right. adapter will be all. Right. Uh, let's have a look. What is all of this? Right. I don't know any what any of this. Let's check the, the switches. Check the win check the window. Oh wait. Hmm. It's a rack! <laughs> <laughs> there are a bunch of cables on it. Somebody cut cut the outer stuff of the of the of the cables. I can see the wires inside. Well, uh, could you mind like you know passing them over here, please? Now that the, the wires, the plug has been cut off, and that's what she's trying to say. Oh, all right. Uh, what else is in here? I wonder what this is. Clover, don't touch it. And... <laughs> <laughs> this thing looks like looks like a voltmeter. And this is the control for that? Gosh, there's so many dials. Why don't you try turning off one of them? Oh, Whee! no, nope, <laughs> nothing. There's no power here, guys. I turned the dial a whole bunch, but... Even if, it's if I turn all the switches, nothing happens. All right, all right. There's pen look, here. Look, look. I don't know what kind of table this is, but... It's... But, but part of it's all black. There's a pen line over here. I think somebody probably used it to make, to make the table black. Hmm. Well, they've only used a pen on one part of it. So there's probably something underneath all, all that pen. Clover, do you think you can erase it? Yeah, sure. Oh, this is a permanent marker. Richard, you have the chemicals. Jun okay. Junpei, do you know how to erase ink from a permanent marker? Race ink from permanent marker, huh? Give me just a minute, Clover. I'll be right back. All right, go go by the window. Uh, this one. Yeah. And then click on it. Clover, use that ethanol. You should be able to wipe off that permanent in ink with it, but it won't get rid of that fucking echo in the background. That, that's just because it's Mike. What, what am I gonna wipe with? Oh well, uh, your clothes, of course. Do it, you little shit. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Please don't look at me like that. You're scaring me. All right, go back. Go by by the big window. Clover, can you use the cloth on the table? Use, huh? Soak it in the ethanol and then use it to wash off all the stuff from the permanent marker, okay? <laughs> <laughs> right, okay. So I gotta soak the cloth with the ethanol. <clears throat> Well, she got the cloth, but she doesn't seem to have a little trouble with... Yeah, she seems to have a little trouble uh, with the bottle of ethanol. When she's ready, I should get the ask her to work on that stuff on the table. Talk on the table again. Put the cloth in ethanol and... No, no! Drink it! <laughs> Junpei! <laughs> it's working! It's wiping the permanent marker off! Huh? No, huh? wait, sorry. Huh? There's some kind of weird drawing underneath the, the permanent ink. What's the deal with that drawing Clover found? Maybe I should ask her to take another look at the table. Take a look at the table. It's important. I wonder what this is. You know, a bunch of numbers in some kind of grid. I can't see them from here. Clover, you've got a pen and a notebook, right? Did you didn't you even know that she did have could you write those numbers down and then hand them to me for the bars? Okay. Roger. Right, now I go back and... Yep. Here, Junpei. I wrote down all the numbers from the desk on, the, on here. The paper with numbers on it acquired. New materials have been added to file screen. Okay, so I need to. Uh, that's not the button I wanted to pull out. File. Uh, you want to go back a few pages? Right. Clover's, Clover's note. Oh, there it is. The note Clover copied from the stand in the laboratory. It has four numbers written in some nice. Okay. Three, two, four, one. And it's in a cr notes and crosses style fashion. So. Oh, you know, it could be like one, two, three, four. Oh, that too. Well, you'll find it. Well, we'll find out once we get to this point. Anyway, <clears throat> go, go back to go back to the window. This one? Yeah. 
Um, examine the examine that machine right next to the robot. Hey Clover, uh, how are the power cables over there? Huh? What do you mean? Like, have you tried putting one in your mouth and biting on it? <laughs> no, I'm not stupid, you idiot. <laughs> Does the plug have three prongs or two? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Let me go look. Guess she has to do some kind of crouch down to get under there. The cable on the monitor has, um... It's got two of these little metal things. What does that mean? That's it. Okay, can you unplug that cable and bring it over here? I'm um, okay, but... Just do it! I mean, but... Well, I can't unplug it. But it's connected to the main computer. I can't take it over to you. Damn it, that's no good. Well, how about I just... How about just the plug? What? The plug. Well, more like um, a connector. It's a sort of thing that makes a plug with the three metal thingies into a plug with two metal thingies. Still useless? No, not useless. Not useless at all. That's just what we're looking for. Okay. Can you hold on for a little bit? And back down she goes. All right, unplugged. I'll hand it to you over at the bars, okay? <laughs> to the to the bars. Here you go. Two pro, the two the two prong plug. Thanks. All right, it's, all right. Combine it. Oh, combine right. that shit. Uh, yeah, I was just trying to see items. Uh, right, so I forgot how to... There we go, and then... There we go. Okay. Put the two-prong plug in the head of the power... D damn it! it <laughs> no, it worked. Damn it, it damn it! It didn't work! You lied to me, game! Sorry, Clover, I'm afraid you're stuck. <laughs> All right. I got the two-prong power cable in my hand. I'm pretty sure this will work. On the desk I go... And let's just plug this thing into the monitor. Alright, that ought to do it. Alright, let's turn on the power. Uh... I don't think that's... I don't think anything's gonna happen. Why not? Well, it's not connected to the main computer. You never know until you try. Pretty optimistic. Oh, that worked. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> it's running on its own? It certainly looks like it. Uh, isn't that kind of weird? What? Not really. Well, it's not connected to the main computer, right? There's just this keyboard and monitor. The only cable connected to this thing is the power cable we just plugged in. So, why is it working? Maybe it's a wireless display. Uh, a wireless <laughs> display? God damn it, you! God damn it, Junpei! Do you not know what a wireless display is? Yes, it connects to your computer wirelessly, hence the name. Have you been living in a cave, Junpei? I don't know. Have you been living in a brothel, Lotus? <laughs> is that why would a brothel? Why would a brothel be living in a whole house? <laughs> why would a whole house have a wireless display? You never know. They might shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, it stopped. Pass Great. With a colon. Uh. Looks like we need to enter a password. Again, there must be a hidden um, room somewhere. Pull me. <laughs> Asshole twelve. <laughs> Don't let really me take it. <laughs> How? Could you go take a look? Yeah, I'm on it. What are you going to do? I'll see if I can do something about this on my own. On your own? Yep, on my own. Lotus. All right, let's kick some ass. We're not playing Space Invaders, you realize that? <laughs> uh... Wait, wait, what? Didn't expect that, did you? Of course I didn't! You're typing so fast, I, I Yeah, that's right, keep fingers. hitting those keys. Faster, what faster. What kind of job do you have? What are you? I'm unemployed at the moment. 
I used to work for a cybersecurity firm, but I quit. Why? Huh? Oh, um, it was just something. Just something. I see. Yeah, and you're just going to be like, oh, I see. Right, okay, sure, fine, fine. It's fine, it's totally fine. Some people have what things they want to keep hidden, Richard. I'm going to try and brute force it. Brute what? A brute force attack is... Well, the short version is that I just attack the thing head on. The long version? A brute force attack is one of the simplest ways to break a cipher. It checks every possible combination until it finds the right one. For a complex cipher, it can take a very long time. I'm writing a program that would run an attack like that on its own. It's not the most elegant solution, certainly. But given the circumstances, there isn't much else I can do. No, oh, but back to what we were talking about earlier. So what she's making a batch, a batch script. We'll find the right combination the to hack display? the system. It's kind of strange if you think basically, basically, yeah. <laughs> How do I put it? Well, let's say you write a program that has she tried Control C yet? All right. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna work. <laughs> why would why would copying it work? <laughs> so you enter Control, well, Control C and Unix does mean cancel. We'll show you too. I didn't, wait, what? Control C and what? Uh, no? Uh, actually, no, it's not very strange. Oh, on. One plus one is two. Of course a caveman like you would think it was strange. You said so just a minute ago. Hmm? You're just not getting it, are you? Who calculated one plus one? The, uh, the, the main computer, right? You said it connected to the monitor wirelessly. Yeah, but someone who grew up in a cave wouldn't know that, right? They'd probably think that this thing here, the monitor, is doing the calculating. Once they've decided that, they'll start examining this monitor. They might poke the screen or something. Ah, I see the color changes when I press it here. Then they might investigate the hardware on the inside. Oh, I see. So this wire supplies the power. Eventually, they might even cut the wires. This ah, is not yes. normal. Just as I expected. When this wire is cut, no results. Therefore, it must be this device which does the calculations. Oh. But the truth is that, just like you said, the computer is doing the calculating. But these cave people wouldn't know that. Because they have no idea... I mean, they are the cave people. They aren't smart. So, uh, what are you trying to say? Uh, guys, um, can you maybe, um, go a little bit faster? <laughs> Shut up, Clover. <laughs> I'm watching, I'm watching Lotus, like, do some shit on the... I'm watching Lois finger the. the I'm, I'm watching Lois finger the, the finger the keyboard. <laughs> Wait, she's what? <laughs> you want to know what that is? A bunch of electrodes into parts of the brain. A scientist examining the signals they send out might say, "Hmm, interesting. So stimulating this part of the brain causes the person to see colors. That must mean this neuron cluster controls that function." Okay, let's see what happens when I cut out this part. Ah, just what I thought. Cutting off this part causes that function to cease. Because oh, I'm colorblind! Ah, just as I thought. Cut out this part, actually killed the person. <laughs> is she saying that the computer's CPU is yeah. in the dummy's brain? No, she's basically just trying to. She's basically just trying to explain how you'd look at how, how you look at a computer from different different perspectives. We just don't know it. We never even think about it. Just like those cave people wouldn't know about wireless communications, we can't imagine that there's some unknown medium that transfers information into our brains. Where we now she's saying that all that, but now she's basically saying that everything that we think and feel is all done from like a main, from a main body, and it's all the information gets transferred to us. Just an output device. Human thought actually occurs somewhere else. <laughs> That's just crazy talk. Maybe that's the cause of Seven's amnesia. If memory is actually stored somewhere else, in some sort of main body somewhere, maybe he hasn't forgotten anything at all. He's just having a difficult time accessing his memories because the monitor, his brain, has been damaged. Huh. I suppose that would explain aphasia and blindsight too. Perhaps they actually can't speak or see. The monitor just isn't functioning properly. Hmm. I guess people with prosopagnosia could be suffering from the same thing. Prosopagnosia. Prosopag what? What? You've never heard of prosopagnosia? No. What is it? Well, put simply, 
It means a condition where the mind can't distinguish between human faces. In other words, my face would look the same as so the clovers or other words, even yours. The Asian effect. So they can't remember. Wow. I mean, that's one way to looking at it, but wow. <laughs> what a way to be both racist and kind of true. Yeah. But basically, prosopagnosia is that if someone who had prosopagnosia, um, for example, we all fa mine, yours, and Leon's faces will look the same as Richard's. No, I don't think so. So you tell me, if I sleep with two different girls, I'm technically not cheating because it's. No, it's still technically two. No, it's still technically the just two different girls. Same. You just don't know. Just their faces may look the same. In fact, the faces could actually look like Richard. Could be your brother. Could be your sister. Could be your mom. I mean, you don't know. Like that's what happens. Oh, oh. Right, that's it. I'm gonna watch some ASMR. <laughs> <laughs> Stop that! <laughs> That's disgusting. That kind of thing existed. And um, uh, what were we talking about? The idea that your brain is just an outward device, like a monitor. Are you serious about that stuff? Not really. I was just kidding for about half of it. What about the other half? Well, I guess I was just adulting. Mm. Adulting? Hmm. Not funny. <laughs> It's nothing more than a story I made up out of boredom. Take it seriously. It was the first thing that came to mind, and I just talked about it to kill time. But, looks like I don't need to talk anymore. Why? I don't have to kill time any longer. Oh, then you finished that brute whatever thing? I certainly did. And let's see what we got. <laughs> Piece of cake. Computer so... explodes. <laughs> <laughs> so your first, so your first puzzle's about to happen. Oh. What the hell is that? No idea. Looks like a puzzle. A puzzle? <laughs> uh, aren't you gonna... I've I never heard of a puzzle before! No, I can't do anymore. It won't let me do any more programming. I've never it, seen a puzzle in a millennia! Nothing. So, there's nothing more I can do. Um... So, before well, you, you randomly anymore. press anything... You know, this reminds what? me of a puzzle. <laughs> Puzzle? Are you mad? <laughs> I did my part. Yeah, uh, well, I guess you're right. Thanks, Lotus. No problem. Make sure you know when you should thank people. Now, I better take care of this myself. Now, no Richard, be, like I said, else. before you press anything... <laughs> God damn it! God damn it! No, I remember it. It's a, I figure I remember it. it has to do with the note, so I need to f get back to the note. No, I know. No, I know. I know what it is. Um, it's that one there. Bo bottom right. And then it's this one. Nope. No, Top it's... right. And then it's this Top one. Top left. Uh, th that was it. Yeah. I just you got guys are cheating. No, cheating. No, not cheat. Not 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 cheating. I remember the flipping thing. Cheating. How is it cheating? Oh my God, Lotus <laughs> is on the screen. <laughs> you might as well have Googled the answer. In fact, you know this? I was just like, we could just watch yeah, yeah. the video and how to pass. You yeah, know this? I, we should just watch another walkthrough. You know, you know what, Chris? You should just get out. <laughs> no, I just kidding. Okay. Yeah, wait, I did. Wait, it sounded like so, something wait, unlocking. <laughs> Goodbye. Wait, where did it come from? Okay, so uh, that should that be that done now. Uh, Look! Ooh, more of these. Look, Jinpei. The lights and the lockers are green. Then we must unlock it with the computer puzzle. A puzzle? Are you mad? <laughs> <laughs> are you mad? There's more than one key in here. This one is small and looks like it, go it goes to some sort of machine. And this one has the Earth symbol on it. I think that's the Earth symbol matches a keyhole in door Ada. <laughs> Well, if that's the case, we probably don't need we, we we probably don't need the Earth key right now. All right then, Earth key then. I'll tuck you away no, deep in my pocket. Like, yeah, that was it. Now it's for the other key. You got the is... activation. I'm gonna have key. fun with you. Wait, what? What key is this? On the ship, I'd say it's not for a door. Probably some sort of machine. Oh. What is it? I wonder, do you think maybe this activation key is for that thing? The activation key? Yeah, it has to be. I feel good about this. 
Okay. Hey, Junpei, do you have a minute? No! Go away! What's up? I, um, I wanted to ask you something. Do you need to use the What's bathroom that? or something? Mm -hmm. No! You went into door five with my brother, right? Did you hear him say, like, anything weird? Like, Everything he says is weird. Huh? Well, let me think. Sorry, Clover. I can't really think of anything. I mean, he you did didn't even really think. You just were like, uh... person or something like that. But that's about it. Okay. Uh, hey, uh, wait a minute. Hmm? Look, I, I don't know if I should ask you things, but if you don't mind, uh, I was hoping you could tell me if uh, is Snake. Uh, I mean, was he? Born. You're talking about his eyes? Yeah. No, he wasn't born blind. When he was a kid, he got in an accident. A really bad car accident. Somebody poked his eyes out! He couldn't see after that. And his arm. Actually, that's right. He did have one arm down by his side at all time, didn't he? His arm? Well, yeah. that and also it also looked like it also looked like a bit of a different color. My brother's left arm is um it's not like a normal person's arm. It's a prosthetic. It's fake. It's not a real arm. The accident hurt him really bad. To save him, they they had to cut off his Did he arm. do anything weird with his arm? No, he didn't do anything weird with his arm. <laughs> uh is that all you wanted to ask me? Look, I'm I, I'm sorry for making you talk about all that painful stuff. It's not that. All right, get back to work. Yeah, okay. sorry, Clover. We're gonna have to ignore you for now. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> you can't no, it leave looks any... like it might be for this. Put it in. This key. The shape sure makes it look like it can go into this machine. All right, I'm turning it on. Okay, the monitor is on now, and it's full of letters. Okay. Check, check it. Type it on this candy bar, it isn't doing squat. It's showing some kind of warning. Power restored to experimental device. Emergency system will activate in the event of a normal, abnormal subject behavior. Okay. Uh, we're gonna have to go around to the robot, aren't we? I don't know, try pushing that big giant machine. Is this like an ex examination table? There's a creepy mannequin here, guys. Alright, okay, hold on. Okay. This is the monitor. There are a whole bunch of cables under this table. Uh, this? Okay. Junpei! The, this thing in here is on now. Yeah, that's because we activated a power on the other side. Could you, like, play with it a little? Okay! <laughs> yeah! I made it through the window! <laughs> I don't think it's working. Nothing happened. Well, maybe she missed something. I should ask her to look around the room again. Uh, get that- get that cable! Yeah. It's a rack. There are some cables on top of a copper wire exposed. Damn it! Uh. What else? There's gotta be something else in here. Uh. Check the robot again. There's something stick out of the mannequin's head. It's like wires or something. What the hell are they doing in there? Uh, why is she all quiet now? They were doing experiments on humans. Probably. Oh man, now she looks sad. Hmm? Uh, now the go wire? back. Go back. Because I don't think the wires are what you want. Okay. Go and... back. Go back! Uh. Okay, so go back. Uh, do we, do we need the cable look. again? No, I don't think we need the cable. Alright, check by the window again. I, we may have, we may need it. It's maybe like one of those things we need to double check. You may need to double tap it. Not that window. Uh. Junpei, thank you so much for everything. Whoa, whoa, what's this all about? And... And also, I'm sorry I messed up. Hey, we can talk about this when we get you out, okay? 
Just hang on, Chloe. I'm gonna get you out of there right away. Yay! I think this is the first time I've actually seen a genuine smile out of this chick. All right. All right. Check the check the big window again. Examine the machine again. Maybe if you increase the voltage. Maybe oh. increase the vo increase the vo maybe increase the voltage. Roger. Will do. Okay, I'm gonna go all the way to max voltage. <laughs> Clover, I don't <gasps> say that to guy. <laughs> max voltage. Hey, wait, Clover. Oh shit. Uh, what? Um, I think um. I must terminate. <laughs> oh my bro! <laughs> 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 oh my god! <laughs> the mannequin's heads! The mannequin's heads! Burnos! Oh god, that sounds like a fire alarm! Oh, what the hell? Fire, fire detected. detected. Fire detected. The emergency system will be activated. Evacuate the room immediately. Oh no, not again! Uh, uh, Quick, get back out! Back out! Go to the door on the left! This one. Open that door! Jump in! Look at the light! Yes, it's green! The emergency system's activated and disabled the lock! Now we can save Clover! Uh, can you actually leave the room without Clover? <laughs> no, I don't think you can. Junpei! Come on, kid, jump! She's safe. <laughs> oh man, Why that you smokes some serious parachute? business. Time to close this door again, I think. <laughs> Clover! Are you okay? Are you hurt? I need to rub something. <coughs> Damn, she's coughing hard. She can't even talk. <coughs> of course I'm alright! What the hell took you so long, you big jerk? I was almost dead! Um. Uh, uh, sorry. Yeah. Oh. sorry, I was going as fast as I could. You two can do this later, right now, and we need to get the hell out of here. The fire's not gonna stay in that room forever. And you're free now. Resident Evil Zombie. You found it. Congratulations, you're not a retard. <laughs>